The River State Governor Nisa Mweke has urged Nigerians not to vote for any candidate supporting the manner in which the currency redesign policy is being implemented in the forthcoming election. Governor Mweke spoke at Opobo Town Sandfield during the River State PDP campaign flag of rally for Opobo Nkoro local government area. The report. Addressing his supporters, the governor explained that any political candidate supporting the manner in which the currency redesign policy has been implemented is an enemy of Nigerians. Wiki said he is convinced that President Muhammad Buhari, who may not have been properly briefed on the hardship the Nile swap is causing the citizens, is also getting feedback on the ill-advised policy and will review the implementation. He pointed out that there is already a cabal behind the policy implementation and they are pushing to install an interim government. Maybe so. This policy is now a policy where people they target. Say, make an advest. When an advest, and I'll go demonstrate. When I demonstrate, lie your feet come. When I your tongue come, they say, oh, no, 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 fit the election again. Then they will say, look, we do interim government. And I will support interim government. No way! This election will go do one. We do one. This election will go do one. This election, now by a PVC, no, no, no. So. This election, now by what team? PVC. Now by what team? PVC. This election is the election of Cavallo. Nigeria. Challenging the former Minister of Transportation, Abiye Sekibo, on virtue of integrity, Governor Wike urged him to explain why former President Olusegun Obasanjo sacked him from his cabinet. Sir, who will be giving this red power? Do you know what the story is? This is the power of the governor. Yes, sir. This is the power of the world. Governor. Now, this red power will end because everything. Now, this red power. Uh, you know, you don't get that, you know, we didn't sign anything. If you didn't there, if you didn't there, you didn't there. I was a minister, I was not sacked. No way. I resigned to run for governorship of River State. Yes, sir. And I ran and I won. Yes, sir. Aksan, you mean resign? No. Aksan, will you resign? No. Wait a second. Earlier, the governor, Fubara, and other PDP leaders paid the court a visit toward the palace of His Majesty, King Danderson Douglas Jaja Jackie V, the Amanyanabo of Opobo Kingdom. He assured of signing the contract for the construction of Opobo Ring Road, which will be completed by Fubara when he wins the election and assumes office as governor. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.